Hi there, welcome back to my channel. This is Diana with The Paper Pineapple and today I'm gonna be uh, showing you what album I'm gonna be using for my Project Live 2023 album. This is a, a light gray album from scrapbook.com. Sorry, I apologize for the shadows. Um, I am recording at night. Um, I work during the day and it's just hard for me to sit down and get a video done. But just real quick, I wanted just to show you um, I like the stitching and it is a 9x12. I'll be doing another 9x12 album. And then here's the spine. I went ahead and put in a 2023. And yeah, I like it. It's great. I used one last year and I really like it. So um, I've already filled it up with all the protectors that I need. Also from scrapbook.com, um, I got a couple of these fold out ones, which I really, really like. Um, and then I just got regular these that are have a two uh, four by sixes and a five three by fours, which is great, which is mainly what I'm gonna be using for the weeks. And then I bought one other design um, also from scrapbook.com. It's also a fold out, but what I like is that it has um, three four by sixes and four four by sixes um portrait and these are landscapes so i thought that was fun and cool that is different so bought a couple of these not sure when i'll incorporate them and also i will also i also have extra 9 by 12 full 9 by 12 so that i can do just layouts and just add different sizes in the album um i apologize that's my frenchie sophie in the background um so yeah this is it this is the album that i'll be using let me know if you have any comments or questions, um, just leave them down below. And I'm gonna go ahead and start my title page, which will start here in a minute, okay? Okay, so now I have already printed my pictures on my new selfie printer. And I decided that I would print my pictures in black and white. And I'm gonna be using um, LE Studios January 2023 kit. Um, I do have an unboxing of that. Um, listed on my channel if you want to go take take a look at that see what cards are in the kit um, and so I just briefly put those out picking some cards from the kit oh uh, I've also uh, made a new weekly card set for uh, weeks 1 through 16 I believe so I will go ahead and upload those and give you a link so that you can download for your future weeks for uh, up to I believe March I believe so yeah if you guys are wanting to use those I'll go ahead and link those and be sure to tag me and let so that I can see you use the cards that'd be so great to see so now I'm gonna go ahead and I went ahead and picked up the 2023 card I just thought it was suitable for a title page and um, the happy new year thought it went well with the 2023 and then I decided that I would do some journaling because I usually do a little uh, snippet of each one of us, um, our ages, and you know what are our likes for for the beginning of the year. So I, I went ahead and printed that out on sticker paper and used one of these cards from uh, a journaling cards from the kit, and decided that I would use this little um, ephemera piece here from. Um, the little pop-ups from the kit as well and it's got three hearts on it I decided that I would stick that here on the on the bottom here below the center and I adhere that and that pretty much uh, takes care of that so now I'm gonna I've decided that I would just leave it simple I didn't want to embellish too much I think this year I'm going to focus more on pictures and stories and not worry so much about embellishing. I felt like that took up a lot of time. Um, and so I just slipped those in and I'm okay with that. Um, I just felt like it needed something else, something sparkly. So I went ahead and pulled out my star punch and got this uh, scraps of some glitter cardstock in silver this year. And I decided that I would place a couple of them here and there, just, I don't know, just to give it some, some, um, something sparkly, you know, just New Year, right? So I just put one in the center there and I using, I decided to try out a new glue. Um, I bought it from scrapbook.com. It is 
uh, Tonic Studios Crafty Craft Tacky Glue. So so far I've um, liked it so far, and um, put a little bit of that on my stars, and I just I put three, two on this side, and one on the top, and I call it good. I think it looks okay, not too embellished. Um, looks fine. I, I like it. It's simple. And so I think I'm, I'm going for more simple <laughs> this year. And so that's pretty much it. Um, I hope you guys like the video. Um, if you do, give it a like. And if you aren't subscribed, please consider subscribing. Thank you so much for stopping by. And I hope you guys all have a great day. Thank you guys. I'll see you guys in the next crafty video. Bye guys.